Now, what else is on the rise that's uh, in, in the mail business and maybe something we need to think about? So it's actually interesting, like those white powder threats, if you look before uh, the pandemic, most of the threats were almost always benign. What we're seeing now is actually more caustic and toxic things that end up being oh. shut up. So you end up with caustic soda, people putting in actual items that will burn and hurt the individuals that they're being targeted. And it's, it's becoming more and more common for some people to be more aggressive with it. So now I was a little spicy here, but now I'm going back in my brain. 2000, 2001, 9-11, terrorists, blah, 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 anthrax, yep. right? That was the flavor of the day. I think this is, um, you know, everybody's kind of COVID fatigued, and they're losing jobs or they're retired, they're leaving their job. Society's got some problems. They do. And the other thing that we're seeing now is most of these are insiders. Oh, so these people know how the facility works. They know how the process, you know, happens from A to Z. And so it's easier for them to get it deeper inside the organization. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Are we catching people? Uh, yeah, they are. It, it's... The, the FBI is responding a whole heck of a lot more than they were three years ago because it's it's either corporate, it's crossing state lines, or it's becoming it's a federal offense with the amount of what they're doing. Now, tell me what is different with...